I'm Johnny Scoville and this is Chase the Heat. It's gonna be a great day. It really is. Hey, happy birthday. Um, I have no idea whose birthday it is today, but somebody's gonna see this and it's gonna be their birthday. So I hope you have a great day today. Um, Tabasco, come on. Who doesn't love Tabasco, right? I can tell you one guy who loves it, Drew Verden. He's a buddy of mine. You guys know him, rider on the bus. Um, a great source of inspiration, not just for me, but for a lot of people. He's just a good guy. Very, very positive. Man, I love positive people. I really, really do. Um, for a lot of reasons. They repel negative people, which is a great thing. I do that. I'm a very positive guy, and I tend to irritate and repel negative people. And I tend to also draw positive people into my life. And that's a good thing. And he's one of those guys. So thank you, Drew. He sent me a package, and this was in it. Tabasco, sweet and spicy. Now, I'll tell you something. It was my gateway sauce. Pepperoncini was my gateway pepper. It kind of started the whole thing. But sauce, my gateway sauce, was Tabasco regular. So it's a special place in my heart uh, for Tabasco. In fact, let's see a show of hands. Who has? Uh, who can look back and say that Tabasco really was their their starting point, their their gateway into hot sauce? See, a lot of us, right? All right, so we're going to uh, be trying this today. It's a new one. That, you know what? Anytime you can do a new sauce, try a new one from Tabasco. Super exciting. Sweet and spicy. Tabasco brand sweet and spicy sauce. It's sweet with a kick of heat. There was something I was supposed to do. Hold on a second. I don't want to forget. something I was going to try to remember. All right, so I apologize. Uh, getting back to this, uh, sweet and spicy sauce. It's sweet with a kick of heat. It's mild, rich, and sweet with more than a hint of heat. You know what? Tabasco has been watching the shows. They have. <clears throat> How many times have I said I don't like a hint of something? But they've been watching. Um, it's sweet and spicy. Uh, it's ideal for slathering, drizzling, dabbing onto grilled meats, fried fish, or fried food. Start over? Nah. Fish and fried food. See, that's, um, I, that's where the average person, the average content creator would say, ah, stop, let's cut a new one. I like that. Uh, it's also great on noodles. Add to marinades, dressing for extra richness, or try as a delicious dipping sauce. Above all, enjoy. You know, I've, I'm sure I've used sauce in ways that the creator of the sauce never dreamed of. Something we do. All right, guys, here are the ingredients. My back is killing me today. Ugh. I need to eat some peppers. It's a great painkiller. I don't think I have any. Oh, I do. I have three uh, dragon's breath. We'll eat those this afternoon. Uh, all right, ingredients. Sugar, red pepper, water, distilled vinegar, pear concentrate, garlic, onion, Tabasco brand pepper sauce, which is distilled vinegar, red pepper, salt, ginger, Xanthan gum and spices. That's interesting. They have their sauce, and one of the ingredients of their sauce is one of their other sauces. Let me see. Have I ever seen a sauce that does that? No? No, I haven't. Interesting. So one of the ingredients is Tabasco pepper sauce. Bully on them. Good for them. It's a good idea. All right. Love the bottle. Um, it's lighter. It never breaks in shipping. And it kind of reminds you of a tattoo bottle. It just does. I'm sure tattoo hot sauce doesn't like it when other people do that. You know, use the... Uh, that type of bottle. Anyhow. Thank you, Drew Verden, for this. Here's the pour. Uh, 
All right. You know what, Hindu? You know what? I don't want this to spill. It's going to. It's oh, clutch. I'm Johnny Scoville, and this is Chase the Heat. Wow. The word savory does not appear on this label. How did that happen? This is a savory sauce. I can't believe savory is not on that list. It's sweet. Um, it's a hint of heat. If you're not a chili head, it's not a hint of heat. So they're accurate, all right? Um, if you're somebody who really likes heat, um, it's still there. This is a good sauce. This would be a great sauce for dipping. It would. This would be a great salad dressing. It's not syrupy sweet. You know what I mean? Sometimes it's too sweet. It's like, this isn't like that. You know what's weird? We talk about the, I've talked a lot on the bus about the signature a sauce maker might have. For instance, you have a sauce maker and they have lots of different sauces, different flavor profiles, but there's something that kind of weaves in all those sauces that lets you know, you can kind of tell who made it. I call it the signature. Anyhow, um, this is strange in that it doesn't taste like a typical Tabasco sauce. Tabasco has a signature that we use in at all their sauces. This doesn't have that. You know what I mean? Very interesting, it's a great sauce. I really like it. Very, very different from the stuff Tabasco usually does. I think it would be a great salad dressing. For a non-chili head, if you're, if you're not accustomed to heat at all, this would probably be a six, all right? For a non-chili head, six or seven maybe, okay? If you're a chili head, very mild. It's probably a three. If you're a chili head, two or three. It moves my needle just slightly, but that's not the, the important thing to me. The important thing is flavor. And people, this is gluten-free. Ah, thank you. All right, guys, a delicious sauce. I like it. Drew, thank you for this. This is wildly uh, uh, versatile. You can put this on. There's a lot of stuff you could use this for. So I am going to today. I like this. This is a good sauce. Um, if you guys have tried this sauce, you could do me a favor and go to the comment section. Uh, the comment section. Let me know what you thought of it. I like it a lot, but I'd like to know your thoughts. All right, so later this afternoon, I'm gonna eat three. Are there three or are there two? We've got three dragon's breath um, in the fridge and I'm gonna eat those, oh, in a couple hours. I'm gonna sit down and relax while this is uploading. Play a little guitar. I'm gonna eat those later on. Got a lot of exciting stuff doing today. A lot of uh, career stuff doing today. So anyway, it's gonna be fun. In the description box, you're gonna see a link for Drew Verdon's Instagram. Please give him a follow. He's a great guy. I'm not putting Tabasco in the description box. If you swing a rope, you're gonna hit a 